Suddenly, a young male comes into view pushing a baby elephant. Oh, oh my God. That's a bull. No. Now he picks it up. Oh, no, no, no. Meanwhile, a female, it's the baby's mother, I believe, comes in and tries to rescue the calf and runs in front of him. He runs after with an erection. He's chasing after the, the infant's mother and backs up toward the infant um, no, who is looking for its mother and goes back and uh, grabs the infant again, pushing it. He still has an erection and puts his, does what we call reach over. He rests his trunk across the infant's back, which is what's done also when a male mounts a female. I've never seen that before. Meanwhile, there's commotion. Uh, and female with the left one tusk is trying to rescue the baby. The male picks up the calf and drops it again. Young female, tuskless female is also there, but then the mother runs past him and the male chases after her. In observations that I've made around uh, the birth of a, a, a baby elephant or around newborns, young males uh, seem to get very excited by the, um, the smell of a new mother. I've always found it quite fascinating because when a baby is born, the whole family will rumble and trumpet and create uh, an incredible commotion. And that commotion attracts a lot of males who come in to see, you know, what what may be happening in the family. Uh, maybe the sounds are similar to when a, when a female is mated. And, and they come in and what I've seen is that the young males get very confused by the smell of the mother and they, they get excited, they get erections, they try and mount the female. The male in question is uh, in his 20s and, and this is the age group uh, that still is not able to discriminate, it seems, between the smells of, of a new mother and of a receptive female, as strange as it seems. Mm -hmm.